Hey everybody, Andre here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to create a piano reduction for a choral score in Sibelius Ultimate. So the very first thing that you're going to want to do is make sure that your whole score is locked in place. So to do that, you're going to click this top line, and then you're going to hold shift, and click the bottom line, and triple click. Now you have the entire score selected. You're going to go over to Layout and Lock Format. So now everything is locked. You see all these signs telling you that everything is set. Next thing you're going to do is you're going to go to Home and you're going to add or remove an instrument. In this case, we're adding a piano. And we're just going to move that down below this, these voices. We're going to hit OK. Now we have a piano. All right, next step is very important. You're going to take the top two lines, or however many lines you have in your score. So same method as before, triple click. And you're going to go over to the Note Input tab. And on the right, there is a Reduce button, which you're going to click. And you're going to use Piano 1 as an existing staff for your destination. OK. As you can see, there's still a bunch of stuff that we're going to have to sort out, but we're, we're well on our way. We're going to do the same thing for the basses. Reduce. Piano 2 this time. And now we have all our notes. And from here, you can do editing as you wish. Like, for example, the most obvious thing that needs to go away are all the lyrics. So you can go to Home and you can go to filters and you can click the lyrics and then delete. And I'm likely going to do the same thing for dynamics. And any other system text that's needed. For example, there's a number one over here and I just don't need that. So I think that's a staff text. So I'm going to hit staff text. As you can see, it's highlighted and I'm deleting it. And it's gone. And then as we go, we'll delete things as needed for whatever whatever purposes we are looking for. Um, as you can see, there is there are many collisions. So you can refer to one of my other layout videos to guide you through there. But I hope you found that useful. Creating a piano reduction in Sibelius Ultimate is very easy and does save you quite a bit of time to use that reduce function. If you found this helpful, do subscribe to the channel, hit like on this video, press the notification bell for uh, notifications when I'm going to be uploading another video. I hope you enjoyed, I hope this was useful, and have a wonderful day.